first part towards giving a great presentation. Research. Witham. The Witham principle. What is in it for me? Your audience, like yourselves, are going to be sitting there going, what am I going to get out of these next two, three hours? What am I going to get? What's, how's it going to help me? How's it going to heal my pain? You need to ask yourself three questions. There's a trinity of questions here. They all point to something very similar. What are your audience's needs? You need to find that out. Don't guess, don't speculate, no. What message is going to benefit your audience? They're going to be sitting there listening to you. They're not going to want to hear about what turns you on. Perhaps they will. But they're going to want to know what's going to benefit them. What pain does it heal? Now, I would strongly recommend, I know you're thinking, well, that's already the same, isn't it? The purpose of that is, is that 96% of speakers do not deliver a great speech because they are unable to answer these questions. They haven't realized that that's what's needed. And that's what I'm giving to you guys and girls now. This is the first question you should be asking, research. And answer that specifically, and you'll be able to come up with a very key message you want to deliver. Like I said, 96% of confident speakers who develop the art never give or will never give a great speech because they don't check out what the audience wants. So what I want you guys to do to start this framework is to turn to the person next to you. I didn't envision you guys would be in circles, but turn to your left or right, doesn't matter, and ask them what interests you. Ask them, where does your passion lie? If you do that, we'll give a couple of minutes and write it down in your book. Okay, so this is the part where we're going to ask just how well you've listened to what your what interests the person next to you. So, who's really eager? I know some of you are thinking, all right, Alan, that's enough of you talking. I want to get up and I want to speak. Who wants to get up and tell us about their partner? Come on, because we'll all be speaking today. So, yeah, great. What's your, so get up. If you could tell us, stand up. Tell us what your name is. Introduce the person next to you and tell us the answers. <laughs> his kind of aim to get this done is to marry well. Uh, that's, his, that's his passion. Very good, thank you. Round of applause for. Okay, we're gonna go we're gonna go a couple more in this session here. Someone from this table over here. Okay, you cracked the smile. Sorry, what's your name there? Mark. Mark, do you wanna stand up and tell us? Okay. Uh, my friend is Rami and his passion is cars. In fact he said that he works for cars. That's what he wants to do. Very good. A round of applause for Mark. There we go. Really, your research can comprise of a number of elements. Now, this is the key one. This is your key focus, and this will have a transformational impact on your speaking and presentation. That's why it's so important, and we focus on that primarily. But when you go and you do further presentation skills, this, and I, I believe Matt's going to... Uh, scan that and email that. I'm getting the nod, the A-OK -okay nod. That you're going to be getting this in a document later on. These are the amounts of different details as a speaker or presenter you would want to make sure because each of those elements could impact your particular presentation. But we won't go through that now. And uh, really what you're going to need for your presentation in the next three days, you'll get very well briefed on that. First stage, focus on your key message around what will benefit the audience. The second half to that equation is communicate that message as though it's your life purpose, as that with enthusiasm, with, with uh, passion. Okay, yeah, not, not quite passion as in like skydiving. Yeah, great, let's talk about the finances. No, talk about it with enthusiasm. Bring it alive. You wanna talk about a subject with energy. That is your first stage to confidence and to building a diamond presentation. 